الحمد للہ و صلاۃ وسلام علی نبی محمد و علیہ علیہ وصحب وسلم مبعد فاسٹنگ ہیز مینی ورچوز اینڈ ون آف دی موسٹ امپورٹنٹ ورچوز از دیٹ دیر از اے گریٹ فرگیونس اینڈ گریٹ ریوارڈ فرام اللہ سبحان و تعالی اینڈ بیکاز آف دی گڈنس وچ از انہیرٹ ان فاسٹنگ ایٹ از کلیئر ٹو اس دیٹ ایٹ کنٹینز دی بیسک ایلیمنٹس فار کنٹرولنگ ونس ڈیزائرس اسٹرینگتنگ ونس پاورز آف پیشنس اینڈ پرسیورنس And it is a preferred type of worship which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is pleased with. And this is a toy type of Islamic training by fasting. In addition to the health advantages that we achieved. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us to fast this holy month of Ramadan and fast outside of Ramadan. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran regarding fasting and regarding the Uh, righteous characteristics that we want to try to achieve ourselves. قال الله سبحانه وتعالى في كتابه الكريم إن المسلمين والمسلمات والمؤمنين والمؤمنات والقانتين وقانتات وصادقين وصادقات وصابرين وصابرات والخاشعين وخاشعات المصدقين ومتصدقات والصائمين والصائمات والخا والحافظين فروجهم والحافظات وذاكرين الله كثيرا وذاكرات عد الله لهم مغفرة وأجر عظيم الله the Almighty says in the Quran Verily the Muslims men and women the believers men and women the men and the women who are obedient to Allah the men and women who are truthful in their speech and their deeds the men and the women who are patient in performing all the duties which Allah has ordained, the men and women who are humble before their Lord, the men and women who give charity, the, the zakat and the alms, the men and women who observe fast, the men and women who guard their chastity, and the men and women who remember Allah much with their hearts and tongues, that they are... promised by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah has prepared for them forgiveness and a great reward, meaning paradise. This shows us the importance of obtaining those important characteristics that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is pleased with, being those people who are believers. And those people, in order to believe, we have to have what? We have to have correct knowledge, correct knowledge of Islam. So we know how to believe in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala correctly. This is not inherited knowledge. And to be uh, truthful in our speech. And that takes striving to go against our inclination. To sometimes lie when, when it's in our favor. Or to be deviant when it's, when it's in our favor. To not be straight and truthful. May Allah forgive us for our many sins. And to also possess the characteristic of abstinence. And being patient. Patient from Patient and obedience to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Patience and refraining from what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has prohibited for us. And patient in upholding the commandments of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And also fasting and being of those people of charity. These are some of the characteristics of Ahlul Khair and Ahlul Jannah. And those are the ones who Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has prepared paradise And those are the people that we want to be from amongst. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us with that. And bless us to be, prepare ourselves for this holy month of Ramadan. And be of those who fear Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And carry that fear and those duties of fasting. And safeguarding our chastity. And safeguarding our, 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 ourselves and our souls from all those things which are prohibited by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah bless us to be of those people who carry those characteristics. In Ramadan and outside of Ramadan. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya na Muhammad.